Okay, as I was saying, because my video keeps cutting out, <laughs> this is the master bedroom. Um, now there isn't a door here, um, so it's kind of open as you can see, but you've got the sink. And then right here to the right, you have the master closet, which has got double shelves. Um, and then this is towel floor in here. You have a separate door um, leading into this area where the toilet is. And then unlike the other house, you actually have a tub shower combo where the other one is just the stand up shower. Um, so as I was saying, every all the bedrooms are on one side of the house. Usually that's a personal preference on whether or not that, you know, you like that or not. So it's just a kind of a long hallway. Um, this is really a great open space right here. I do like how this is nice and open. All right, let's go check out the back yard. So a nice little deck out here as well. The backyard in both of these houses are pretty fantastic, if you ask me. Nice and shady. Um, now, the other house is fully fenced, where this one is not. Um, look, they have fruit trees as well. So, I know that you had mentioned getting a, a dog at some point. You definitely would have to get the yard fenced in, or finished fencing it in. So, you would need one on the side. Um, actually, it looks like that. Just one on the side, because they've got one on this home right here. So, that's the back door. I believe this goes out for, from the garage, but let's go check that out. little single car garage there's that door right there so if you had a smaller vehicle you could definitely park in here um, I do want to point this out the peeling of the the popcorn because this isn't a heated and cold area that is just that is normal now you don't have pull down stairs but you do have looks like an attic space um, it's a nice little garage here all right, and that is it for this house.